I am the seed of the free, and I know it. I intend to bear great fruit. Some decisions in life are hard. I can't take you with me. But I need you to be strong. You hear me? The truth is powerful and it prevails. I didn't run away in the night. Instead, I held my head high and walked away in broad daylight. Bring water. It's okay. Take this off. Where are the children? Couldn't I bring them? This is a Bella Van Wagen. As you know, New York Emancipation has been signed by the legislature and will take effect on Freedom Day, July 4th, 1827. Male slaves born after the 4th of July in 1799 will be emancipated when they're 28 years old under New York laws. Your complaint to the jury is that your son, who is set to be freed in roughly 22 years, has been illegally sold to a plantation owner in Alabama, sealing his fate to remain a slave for life. He was promised freedom by New York state law. It's not legal to sell himself. Are you a free woman, Miss Van Wagen? I reside with the Van Wagenens and assist them with chores. And I understand that they took you in after you ran away from the Dumonts. They are my friends. Your Honor, she's free to leave as she pleases. And you obtained your freedom by making the decision to leave your children on the Dumonts' plantation. Her case is valid under the legal provisions provided by the Emancipation, Your Honor. Miss Van Wagenen, would you please sit down? I wasn't trying to leave my children. When I left that house of bondage, I left everything behind. Do you ever look up at night, Judge? Those are the same stars, and that is the same moon that I knew looked down on my children. Do you know how many nights I couldn't sleep? Do you know how many times I looked up at those stars hoping? I may have left my son, but he knows I left for freedom that will also be his. I could not give him freedom if I didn't go get it for myself.
I have died a thousand deaths. Do this one thing to give me life. His name is Peter. He's seven years old and I want him back. Ten minutes, and we move on to other cases. Court is recessed. You've done your part. It's in God's hands now. I'm tired. I'm torn. I'm Trust in you, Lord, there is hope, there is peace, your way, my path, my Mrs. Bella Van Wagenen, the grand jury has found favor in your case. Therefore, we will have the courts to send an order to Mr. Gadney to have him appear in court to get your son back. Court is adjourned. I was the seed. Standing in that courtroom, I felt like I could lead my people to freedom.